up love YouTube, welcome to another episode of Smash Brothers Weekly News something with a doodah. Yeah, I'll just call it Weekly News Super Smash Brothers doodah. You know what you saw when you tapped, clicked on this video. So yeah, it's Weekly News and let's get going. So, Mega Man has two custom special moves, which means you can customize moves. The bird is beat, that's probably a recovery attack, I'm pretty sure, and there's another version of the leaf shield. I don't know what it'll do, maybe it'll have more power, maybe the shield will be even better, who knows, we'll find out eventually. This Sakurai recently showed us where you, um, Equip your power ups for Smash Run. There are a lot. And here, there's like the Power Bomb, Launch Ring, never heard. We haven't seen that yet. Strong Kick, Auto Recovery, Back Shields, Spinning Blade, Rocket Bell, and a bunch of other stuff. You don't buy these things. Like, you choose an amount. I don't know, like maybe you can only choose like 25. Oh, yeah, total weight 25 out of 25. Or maybe like they have like a certain weight stuff. Yeah, you don't use any of your coins on it, so, yeah, I'm kind of glad you don't have to spend your coins, because I'll be spending mine on trophies. The Nightmare Wizard from the Kirby series is in his assist trophy. He looks more like a boss, I mean, he's huge, but he's in his assist trophy from the Kirby series. What game is he from? I have no idea. I'm not a Kirby fanatic. Sakurai also showed us treasure chests from Smash Run. You have these items, he says they're very important because, you know, they give you the, like flying stuff, there's bags full of coins, like you see those two bags there. Okay, that, you see that gold bag with the wrench? I have no idea, maybe it's a new setting? I have no idea. I really don't. We'll find out when the game's out or when the next Nintendo Direct comes around town. I feel bad for you Zelda fans because Gearham is an assist trophy. Yeah. I don't know. I, like, I, Gearham, if it was in the game, I actually might have played as him. I'm not a Zelda. You know, usual Zelda character player. I mean, if Gearham was in the game, I'd be like, okay, I'll play as Gearham. He looks, I don't know, he looks pretty cool. Also, for the first time, they showed us the, um, the music, or the sound studio, or sound test, uh, on the 3DS version. Now, if you are, now look at this. It's a Zelda song, and it has Gearham on it, but Gear, I don't know, Gearham's a tro it's a trophy, so he's not gonna be a character. Maybe recent, maybe, you know, this week or something, they'll announce Gandorf. Now, there's a leak online that... Gandorf is in it. Oh yeah, we're gonna have an entire video on this leak. Like, it is so legit. I'm pretty sure everything on here is real. The, um, classic mode, you know, it goes on a map, you choose who you fight next. Um, you can choose, kind of like in Kid Icarus Uprising, where you choose your intensity, and the higher your intensity, the more the prize. In the same comments, Sakurai said that Master Hand will await you at the very end of Classic Mode, but if your intensity is higher, you will have a, there will be a different final boss. Or a different clim climatic boss, so. Yeah, if you look at it, it the intensity is 7.0. I don't think I'll ever, well maybe I will, because you know, in Classic Mode it won't be last, like, I don't know how good you have to be. I don't know how good 7.0, maybe I can do it, I mean 7.0 is like, oh, I mean, I'm looking at a 7.0, oh my gosh, and, yeah, so I'm gonna do my master hand, I'll get better, yeah, and then I'll even show you guys who this final boss is, I think it's gonna be Taboo, no, well, master hand is the lower, Taboo might be the higher, I hope it's not crazy hand, nobody likes crazy hand, I don't know if there are any fans, like, I love crazy hand, or, Crazy Hand should have his own game. Crazy Hand should have been the bad guy in Brawl. Um, yeah, I really hope it's Taboo. Taboo is weird. 
I don't get what the... How the heck did they come up with Taboo? I have no idea. Really, I don't. They also revealed Samus' new costume. His costume is one that I really just don't like at all. I really don't. It's weird. I'm done talking about this. Well, that's the end of the episode. Right after I'm done with this video, I'm going to do an entire video all about the leak on the internet. You've probably seen it by now, well, if you haven't, just watch the episode. Just a warning, if you care about spoilers and everything, don't watch it. Or if you just want to spoil yourself, then just watch it still. I really can't help it, but spoil myself. Like, like this is one of the most legit leaks I've ever seen. The Palatine one, really legit, like... There's a Tails one, but, like, the Palutena one, and I don't know how viral this one's going, but it's, like, really viral, like, it's so legit, it's, I'm actually pretty positive that it's true, really, just right after this, I, yeah, it's probably one of the most legit leaks I've ever seen, one of the only legit leaks I've ever seen, because it's one of the only leaks I've ever seen, that wasn't all, like, Rise of the Planet as the leaks, or, you know, like, Leak Busters and Rising Leak or America's Got Leak or something like that. Really, you know, Smash Brothers. We'll see you when. Well, I'm not gonna see you. You're watching this video, so you'll see me talking and stuff. I won't see you. That sounds kind of creepy. Don't worry. So see you later, alligator. You're not an alligator. I'm sorry. But that, that, that's a stupid say. It doesn't make any sense. See you later, alligator. I was like, is that offensive? Is that a euphemism for something? I'm not an alligator here, people. Come on.